In today's video, we're going to see what AI chooses as these rappers' best and worst albums. We have people like Drake, 21 Savage, and some others in the mix today. And listen, guys, we're trying to experiment with some new content. So if you guys have suggestions for future videos for the NFR Plus channel, make sure to leave them in the comments section. But let's get started with the first rapper we're going to plug into ChatGPT. Who is it at? It's going to be Drake. It's going right. to be Drake. Okay, any predictions? Any predictions? I'm going to say... For the best, it's going to say take care because that's like the easy yeah, fucking think, NPC ass answer. I think they're going to say, well, well, no, you don't have NPC yeah, take. Yes. If you it, say, it's not an NPC take, but it's like hey, it's the obvious one. You know hey, what I mean? Okay, yeah. That's and fine. Then, uh, that's the, the obvious one. And then worse, I'd probably say probably honestly, never mind. Scorpion. No, because this member, it clocks out at 2019. Oh. So I think I think it's going to say Scorpion, right? Okay, let's see. All right, let's see. What are they giving us? By the way, what are we naming the AI today? Last episode was Guillermo. It was Guillermo. This time... I want to do Andy. You want to do Andy? We're calling him Andy. It's basic, though. I know, but he's basic. Let's call him Andy. You know what? I chose last time. You'll choose this time. Andy it is. So, best album, what do you think it is? Take Care. It is Take Care. Okay. Worst, um, worst album, Views. Why? Apparently, it was less consistent compared to his other projects, and it received a mixed reception. Uh, um, I, I don't mean, know. Yes, I don't know. It, 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 views did receive a lot of mixed reception. That's why. That's without that goes without saying. But I mean, Scorpion did too, and there was way more bloat. I mean, for me, Views is a skipless album. I've given that take before. Scorpion, on the other hand, has its misses. You could trim a lot yeah, of that album absolutely. off. No, I, I, well, we both have it in our top that's five it. for ranking. So how do you have Views as the worst? Uh, that's very interesting. But I okay, mean, yeah, we go on. Let's go on with that. Tyler for the sure. Creator. Next one. Tyler the Creator. Any predictions? predictions? What do you got? Um, for the best, I'm going to say Flower Boy is I think probably Flower what it's going to go yeah. with. And then worst, I'd probably say Goblin. Worst Goblin. I mean, is Bastard going to be included in this, you think? I think maybe for studio albums, because if they take like Wikipedia into consideration... I think, I think, like, I think they'll, they'll say Cherry Bomb as the worst. You think they'll say Cherry Bomb? Yes. Because a lot of people Why? hate it on Cherry Bomb. Yeah, but you also have a lot of articles of Tyler saying that he doesn't like Goblin himself. True. Or Yonkers. So, like, does that take it to consideration? So, best album, we're both wrong. It, 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 it spat out Igor as the best okay, album. Okay, because 2019 is the cutoff. Okay, there we go. All right. Worst album, what is um, it? Goblin. Oh, okay. Yeah, that but was pretty it, easy. But it said Tyler, the creator's discography doesn't have a universally agreed upon worst album. That's true. Oh, that's I mean, maybe, hey, maybe Goblin. Smart take. Hey, hey, Andy's learning. It's true, though. A Andy knows what's up, all right? He's, right. he's out of the... Uh, Andy's doing well today. He's out of the toy factory, and now he's... Uh, He's fallen into his real, uh, his real, <laughs> real passion, calling. you know? Real calling. Real Hip -hop calling, podcast. Sure. <laughs> Absolutely. So Goblin as the worst, I agree with that take. Igor as the best, I also agree. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Okay. Andy the, the, nailed it here. Who's w, next? W for Andy. Okay, Playboy Cardi. Let's see what he says Playboy here. Playboy Cardi. I think he says best whole lot of red. I think he says worst self-titled. A lot of red, 2020. Doesn't make the cut. But imagine, yeah, but imagine, is, is that for real though? Like, yes, Chad GPT is like... Empty in, in, in the mind from everything 2019 above. I don't know how facts that is. It's, it's facts. So what happens if he says whole lot of red right now? I'll give you 20 bucks. You don't have to give me anything. All right, fine. <laughs> okay. I don't need anything. Playboy Cardi. What do Let's we got? Let's type it in. Best album from Playboy Cardi, Dial It. Okay. And worst album, Self-Titled, because oh, there's, not, there's okay. no other option. So Fuck. there you have it. I want to see, bro. I believe in you, Andy. I feel like Andy for <laughs> sure has recollection of his memory from 2020 onwards. He does not, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, maybe if you get like the, what do you the think exclusive, to Andy? I don't know, man. I think he got robbed. Got into a got bad, hit, uh, yeah. bad wreck. I don't know, man. He lost it. it but um, hit over the head. Could be. It's possible, bro. But um, Dial It and, and Playboy Cardi self-titled. Yeah, I mean, pretty, pretty, I mean that's not. A hot is taste. it like changeable for you? Like you don't care one day it's one, one day it's the other. No, I prefer Dial It. I think but, Dylit's a better experience. Uh, but I, I will say this. Yeah, I guess you could say it's interchangeable for a lot of people. If you're only looking at those two projects, like what could you really say is his worst, you know? His yeah. worst album is still a fantastic list. They're on par. And it's like you're, you're getting the same style from Cardi for the most part on uh, both albums, more or less. More or less. You're getting the, you know, the, 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 the cloud trap type of vibe. I love that Cash Cardi Yeah. Um, okay, like, you want to continue with this? Let's keep on going. 21 Savage. 21 Savage. For his best, probably I am greater than I was. They'll, they'll probably go with that do you think, one. Do you think they're going any Savage Mode projects? Well, they wouldn't be able to go Savage Mode 2. They wouldn't be able to go with that one. I think worst, they're going to give it to Issa, which is fair. I think that you do have uh, a lot of like cringe auto-tune performances on Issa. Um, and best is probably going to be... Uh, I, I am greater than I was. Than I was. Let's, okay, see. let's see what Andy has to say. Best album, Savage Mode. Let's go. Okay, the, Andy's and, taking yes, his sir! fucking W, baby. Let's Fuck fucking yeah. go. Showcases his dark, menacing style. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, it does, Andy. Um, and then worst album, <laughs> it's album. 
There we oh, go. There we go, bro. Andy's taking W's today, except for Drake's with views. Yes. That was Besides the only that. Yes. So far, Andy has been. I would. I would have talk. a beer with Andy. I would take him out for a fucking beer, talk some what, music, talk about how of, much what, we what like of, Savage Mode. What type of beer do you think Andy likes to drink? I think Andy is. He likes a dark Guinness. Yes. I think Andy he's likes a, a dark Guinness. Guinness. He's, he's a, a cultured man. He's someone that doesn't have a beer too often because you know he'd rather have his his glass of Chardonnay. But once he has the beer. Once he stoops down to the beer level, he's gonna go classy and sophisticated with. Yes, it, he know? will. He'll have a he'll, he'll have a pint of Guinness. Absolutely. All right, Outcast. Let's see what he says for Outcast. Outcast. Okay. I so mean, now everything's considered. There's no cutoff. W- I don't think we ever spoke about like our our top one and like worst Outcast. Well, no, album. I think people would probably know that they our, probably know our best because Aquemini was high up in our top ten albums of all time list. But what about your worst? Would it be Stankonia? No. Would it, it be, be Southern Playlistic Cadillac music? I think I'd probably go Southern. Yeah, I'd probably, or, or, go, I, I'd probably go Southern, but it was so pivotal to forming their sound. Like, people don't know what that did for Southern hip hop. But if we're counting Idlewild, obviously, yeah. soundtrack, album, that would be the worst. So, best album prediction? I Is have it in go- front of me. Uh, fuck. I, I feel like the internet has different opinions than you and I for Outcast. Stankonia is super popular yeah, that, that in, in the true. internet. Did they say Speaker Box? It's not speak about. It's a Quemini. Okay, there we go. Fuck Andy. Andy knows what's these. up. But least favorite album, it's what I thought would be said. Idle Wild from 2006, the soundtrack for the for the movie of the same name. Um, easily their worst, but it's hard to count that. All right. Like, that's I, 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 that's, I that's like good though. I feel like for any artist, there's always an asterisk when it's a soundtrack yeah, album. Like, even think... Dr. Dre with with Compton, there's an asterisk there. You know, it's still a great listen though. Of course. So do you of think course. Andy played it safe this round? He played it safe, you know. Yeah, he didn't Andy want to ruffle any feathers. He didn't want to get anyone upset. You know, he, he's, lo- he's looking forward to that beer he's going to have with us, so he doesn't want to fuck up that, that experience, you know? Absolutely. But okay, let's go on to the next one. Mac Miller, another celebrated discography. Ooh, this is where is things touchy. might get, yeah, this might get dicey. What do you th- where I, do you think I think he goes? he goes Blue Slide Park because it is, like, even when you go on, like, all the review sites, it is the lowest rated album. And for the best, that's, I don't know. That's up for debate. That's up for debate. I think he might go swimming or, because swimming's Grammy nominated, or maybe watching movies. I, maybe The Divine Feminine, actually. Really? I no. think that, that got a lot of good reception. I don't think Andy's heard The Divine Feminine. You don't think so? I, I, don't, think Andy, I don't think Andy's a softie no. like that. Yes, I, I don't think is. he's been into... Yeah, yeah. Andy uh, goes home to his woman at night. Don't worry about mm-hmm. Andy. Don't worry about Andy. I don't know, man. Don't worry about I, I'm Andy. I'm getting a, a macho vibe from Andy where, like, he doesn't want to be known to, to list to anything that's outside of, like, hardcore shit. But we'll see. We'll see what he says. What do you think Andy says here? I think Andy says... Uh, the, he said, yeah, he said swimming and then he said Blue Slide Park. Yeah. Those are your options. He said Blue Slide and Divine. I just want to throw Divine So, up. best is swimming. Yeah, he said that um, after his tragic passing, he received critical acclaim for the mature and introspective content. W, Andy. I like the explanation there. And then, yeah, the worst being Blue Slide Park. Oh, wow. Okay, listen, Andy's kneeling these. You're right. Maybe Andy is not a softie. He's not a softie, man. He's not. He smokes his tobacco out of his pipe. Absolutely. Um, He lights it up. He gets it All right. What's next here? All right. Next, we have Lil Wayne. Where do you think it goes with this one? Louisiana. I Um, think best is between C2 and C3. Yeah. I I think the best has to be one one of of those Carter albums. The worst... Rebirth, for sure. Rebirth needs to be the the only one that you could really put in. I mean... That is like the unanimous answer for Lil Wayne. I am not a human being number two, you could argue, but there's too many fucking mega bangers on there for me to want to consider it. So it has to be Rebirth. And? What is it? Let's see if Andy remains a man of the culture here. Best album, the Carter three. They yeah, know. he shares my take. Yeah, that's that's good. That's good. Least uh, preferred album is Rebirth. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah I, I, he's it, not, he couldn't that, have he gone any not, other way, bro. He he literally has not missed today except for views. Listen, bro, he has the internet forums at his fingertips, and he's putting them to fucking use. <laughs> he ain't fucking around. He's not going through just Reddit. Like he's doing his homework. Okay, for but let's these. get a bit more complicated. Let's go through Denzel Curry's catalog. Ooh, see, L- let's this see is where Andy, Andy might struggle. Uh, let's see where Andy goes. This is this. like, is Andy a rap caviar kind of guy? Or has he delved into the deep forests of hip hop? But the thing is, is that it's not going to say uh, melt my eyes. It, it won't. won't say melt my eyes. He could say taboo. He could, could say, say imperial. imperial. He and could say um, nostalgic. We'll see. You think he, we're going to include any like EPs and stuff like that in here? Probably not, right? No, probably not. I think it just says studio albums. Yeah, depending hopefully. On the form. Hopefully, yeah, Andy depending listens on the form to the instructions. 
Let's see how obedient Andy is with the instructions. <laughs> um, hey, best album is Taboo. Okay, there we go. Um, and then the least preferred, Nostalgic 64. You know what? what? That, that, that makes sense. Take. Yeah, that's a good take. I would agree with that. Andy knows the Denzel Curry fan base. Andy what are we going to say? Andy what is, knows What are we going to say bad about Andy? But what about Zoo? Because Zoo is an album. Uh, came out 2019. Yeah. It's no, a, no. Probably it's still 60, slightly yeah, above I, 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 I 64. Probably, but I still go 64. Yeah, tough. I like all the freestyles. I like the Florida aesthetic. All right, let's go tough. to the next one. West Side Gun. Let's see if he's into Griselda. West Side Gun. Let's see where he goes with this you one. You know what? I feel like with West Side Gun, we might see no information available. You might get Andy just blanking out. You don't think? No, no, no. no. Andy knows. Let's Andy see, has man. to know. Let's see how but, tough but he, he can't, is. But he can't go with uh, Pray for Paris. Can't. Predictions. I, I didn't look either. I think he goes Fly God as his best. And then worst, I'm not sure because it's such a toss-up. Like he has mm. like West Side Gun doesn't really have like I would go and then you pray for me as one of his worst but one of the uh, Hermes probably let's see what do we got best album what the hell what do he say pray for Paris what how did I tell you <gasps> fuck yeah no, but that was for the other you said if Playboy Cardi spits no, it out twenty God, bucks I'm not gonna you no keep, fuck I'm not gonna take your Too twenty bad. bucks don't worry <laughs> <laughs> don't, bro don't worry keep your twenty but I told um, you Andy is I able to remember it. yes is it twenty twenty one then maybe. I, I know there's a cutoff point. Maybe I got mixed up and I thought it was 2019. Best album, Pray for Paris. W. That's my same take for West Side Gun. And then the worst. He's like, anything off the Hitler or Hermes her series. That's what he said. Okay, that's, He's yeah. like, anything off of there. <laughs> <laughs> Just take your pick as if like they're all bad. Fuck. Come, on, Come on, Andy. Andy. But what, what did I tell you, bro? I knew he Fuck. had recollection. Um, sheesh, bro. So I guess... Oh, it says here... My last knowledge update was January 2022. Interesting. So I guess they updated the software here. Interesting stuff. Because I went, I went to part of time. It was either 2019 or 2021, man. I'm telling you. I think it was maybe for last year's video that we did. I guess. I just remember seeing like one of those years. So he didn't go with CLB as Drake's worst? If that's the case. Yeah, it's true. He didn't choose CLB with views <laughs> over CLB and fucking uh, Squirtle. Andy, listen. Listen, we might have to cancel the, the, the pub outing now, Andy. I don't know, I don't man. Know what's going on. But okay, JPEG Mafia. JPEG Mafia. Let's go. Uh, l let's see how deep he gets. So are we going to get LP here? I think, you, I think you're going to get LP as your And LP as the best, you yeah. think? And as the worst? Probably Cornballs. Maybe. Probably Cornballs. I'd probably put, yeah, all my heroes as the worst. Let's see. Is that, those are your final guesses? I think that's the final guesses, yeah. What does he have to say about JPEG? Damn. Andy's stalling right now. Uh, oh, there we go. He came through. He came through. You, do you think he called a friend? You <laughs> yeah. He probably texted Fantana. Yeah. <laughs> what should I say he here? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah. He used uh, his fucking helpline there for sure. <laughs> but best project, Veteran. Oh, okay. All that's right? interesting. That's, that's okay. Fair. That's I, fair. I, I yeah, really yeah, enjoy cool. Veteran. And then he's like, for the worst, opinions might alter. He'd go with one of his earlier mixtape, The Second Amendment from 2015. I've never even heard it. Have you heard um, it? I haven't gone through the Second Amendment, actually. I haven't either. Um, but That'd yeah. interesting, though. Um, is it was JPEG Mafia the last artist here? That is the last so artist. So how do you think Andy did today? What I do you think? I think he think? did good. I think he genuinely did good. I have, some, I have some questions with Andy. I think he cheated a bit with Fantano on this new JPEG one that we just did. He but, did. Uh, but for the most part, though, you look at Drake, you look at Tyler. Well, Tyler was good. Tyler, Tyler was, good. was good. Mac Savage Miller was, good. was fair as well. Yeah, Denzel Curry was cool as well. Wayne was good. Um, for the most part, the only questionable ones were really like the West Side Gun worst answers, like yeah. take anything off of the Hermes series, and then after that for Drake saying views, like over like CLB. But Andy, you did great today. Actually, you did as good as Guillermo. So like yep. we have a little, uh, we have like a little like, a rivalry. Like, Guillermo and Andy, who's the better AI? Uh, we're gonna bring Guillermo back into our next uh, episode. Yes. But listen, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys want to stay up to date with our entire NFR Plus upload catalog, guys, do not worry. Turn on your notification bell because we are uploading here every single Thursday. Thank you so much for watching this video, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.